Hey, Dexter here. Today I'm going to show you how the version 6 GUI is coming along. I'm going to start in a single pane mode. All the tabs are in one pane here. Let's uh, load up a group and see how that tab, a new tab popped up with the uh, group list for the uh, auto group. I'm going to uh, narrow this down to some vets and download a few Corvette pictures to fill the thumbnail tab. So uh, once those come down, we'll click over here on the thumbnails and there are some vets. So let's uh, change this to a two pane view. I'm going to grab the tab and move it down onto the crosshair selector right there. So now we have a two pane view. Let's uh, move the download tab down too. And when you want to make it an additional tab, click right in the middle of the crosshair and it'll pop up as another tab uh, in the lower pane. So you can change the order of the tabs just by clicking and dragging like that. And you can change the position of the tabs. Under View, Switch Tab Position, it'll go to the uh, lower or the upper part of the screen. It'll just toggle. Let's create a third pane now with the Groups tab. And we'll just move that over like that. Three pane view is like version four. A lot of people seem to like that, so you can do that now. We still have the pinning feature. You uh, click on that stick pin there, then it will hide the tabs. If you dwell over, then they pop up again. And uh, to pin them back again, while they're popped up, you just go over and click the stick pin again. And they're docked again there in the lower pane. So the last thing I want to show you is how to change a theme under View Application Look. You can change the color scheme. Um, that's what Office 2003 looked like. Uh, let me change it back here. We'll go to, um, we'll leave it at the Visual Studio 2010, that color scheme. So that's all I want to show you for today. I hope this video was helpful. Later.